Amen. We thank God for the nations. I'm here not as a part of the program, but as a passion and a burden. In 1993, we started praying for nation. We were mandated to pray for the nation. You know why? Because Jesus, the great commission, he said, go ye into all the nations. That's God's mandate. And here at the Harvesters, he spoke again, 1993, we started calling all nations and going into the nation. In fact, I, I used to say, I used to go, then first part, bishop to go. Now he goes all the time, I'm the one city. But the reality, all of us, we want to have that mind. It is God himself who spoke about nations. And we are so blessed to have nations here. All of you, you are from different nations. So please, for God's sake, be concerned, even if it is your nation only. Don't forget where you came from. But today, we are going to celebrate the nations that are having independence. Hallelujah. The beauty part of it, we pray for nations all the time. In fact, yesterday, the third Saturday, every continent, there were people praying for the nations. There were people thanking God for the nation. So today we are going as a harvesters on this third Sunday. We are going to thank God for the nation, for your nation, but now for those who are celebrating. I want to find out who is here from the outside who came because they knew we are praying for the nations today. Please could you stand, stand up? If you are from this nation, okay, let me name the nations. If you are from Brazil, because we are going to thank God for Brazil, Belize, Costa Rica, please, if you are here, please could you stand? El Salvador, Guat Guatemala, Honduras, Nicaragua, Mexico, Chile, St. Kitts and Nevis, Mali, Guinea-Bissau, Botswana. Is anybody here? Oh my goodness, maybe they are coming. I know they are coming the second service. But we who are here, let us thank God for these countries. And those who are watching online, if you are from those nations, if you know somebody from this nation, know that the harvesters, they take time on this third Sunday to pray for you, to thank God for you. Because God knows why you were born in that nation. And let us all of us stand up as we thank God for this nation. To us as harvesters, again, I've sent messages, I'm sure you have heard, on the um, covenant family that please, we want somebody who will be ready to say, I'll represent my nation. And trust me, God will bless you. Because when you are concerned about somebody else, then God will be concerned about you. Therefore, please let us, okay, we are going to start again. I'm going to start again to call the nation. Brazil. Be Should I follow that? Okay, Mexico. It will take forever. God knows, okay? So you see the flags, okay? You see the flag. Brazil, Belize, Costa Rica, El Salvador, Guatemala, Honduras, Nicaragua, Mexico, Chile, Santa Kitts, Nevis, Mali, Guinea-Bissau, Botswana. Father, you have heard these names. You know the people who live in those countries. 
Therefore, we thank you. All the embassies, all the representatives from those countries who are in America, we give you praise, Father God, because indeed you are the God. Psalm 24 says, The earth is the Lord's and the fullness thereof. We believe the Lord right now. You are sending ministering angels to bless those country, to touch those country, somebody to witness to them. Some of them don't know you, Lord, but we know by your own Holy Spirit, as we cry, as we pray, as we thank God for this nation, miracle will happen because indeed you are a good God. You never forsake us. Thank you, Lord, for these nations. In Jesus' name we have prayed. Amen. Tell somebody, tell somebody, please next month all the nations try to win somebody for Christ in Jesus' name.